My uh, first guest tonight is the greatest stand-up comedian who has ever walked the face of the earth. He asked if I would say that. I did. He's appearing at the Orleans Casino on uh, August the 21st to the 23rd. I, I, I used to go to the Orleans. It's awesome. It's an awesome casino. They got, they've got uh, uh, slot machines. <laughs> And uh, uh, there's an Emmy-winning documentary called Mr. Warmth that is now out on DVD in Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at this, everybody. Italian? What is, what is your heritage? German. German? Get a rope. I'll tell you this. What's your name? Fritz? Hans? What? Frank my ass. Frank. never met one in World War II. My name is Frank. Does this relax you, Frank? <laughs> Please welcome the legend that is Don Rickles, everybody. Don. Don, welcome. Okay, welcome. that's it for me. Yeah. How are you, Don? It's not bad. It's not a carnival. It's a show. Hey, it's not nice me. young people. You have a nice young audience, really. Nice. <laughs> Except the, the guy here in the front with the Washington haircut. Yeah. Get him a get him a cherry tree and get him. Out of here. Okay, how you been? I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Don't pick on the man. How 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 how, how long have you have you had that? that, 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 that. No, 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 I don't have that. No, you're good. You're it's good. It's the heat's getting to me. It's August. I no, always I, get like this in August. A lot of a lot of, lot of good talk about your show. A lot of people have been telling me they're turning it on. Really? Uh, <laughs> yeah, twelve thirty at night when when the wife's just laying there going, sweetheart, you want to fool around? I said, no, Greg's on. Greg's yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. When you're married forty four years, you got a Jewish wife. She just lays there and goes. Oh. <laughs> You young people will find out. It's not all the big job, you know? It's, there's more to it. <laughs> now, you've got to enjoy life. How long are you married now? Uh, six months. Ah, good. <laughs> He's really crazy about it, isn't he? Ah, six months. <laughs> no, I was doing that thing. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I heard that this has just come out in Canada. Congratulations. Well, <laughs> <laughs> You made it in Canada. Well, what are you talking about? Like I'm a Mountie. I'm not a Mountie. <laughs> Canada, Canada, Don. Canada. Canada, that's the big time. Howard Blank and all those people up in Vancouver and all the great people yeah. up there. And I, I'm delighted that it's on there. And I, by the way, I won two Emmys for that. Yeah, right. Yeah. Shut up. You, yeah. you can keep the applause down. Yeah. Uh, no, two Emmys, you know, I'm in the business 50 years. 50 years. And I said when, I, what's this on tape? I know what I'm saying. Yeah, you know, I can't, yeah. What do you, reminded what you. Do you play back Charlie? I yeah, mean, yeah. Talking to the FBI, yeah? Where were you? In the car, in the car, in the car, in the car. <laughs> so, don't right. do that unless your apartment needs heat. Yeah, all right. <laughs> you don't remember that in New York when we were struggling actors. We used to do, all right, all right, I'll turn on the heat. Anyway, I didn't have to go there. Sit up. It's not a toilet. Sit up, sit up. <laughs> Guys sitting here in shorts like this. <laughs> You want a magazine? Anyway, uh, they, don't know, they don't understand that. They say that's too fast. I forgot where I was working. Put up the signs. Anyway, so I went. You don't have signs? That was good the way you turned around like that. That really, like, that really yeah, helps yeah, 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 I'll do it again. Helps the joke that went in the yeah, toilet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm here to help. I'm yeah. here to serve. No need to holler. I'm right on top of you. No, no, this is, this is that's part. That's my thing. I do. I yell stuff in a phony Scottish no, accent. You, the Scottish accent. Is great. I've never been to Scotland. Have you not? They no. love you there. You know. Yeah, well, I'm not go. going. Why not? <laughs> Too many other great places to go. And I have nothing against Scotland. There's Italy. There's Israel. No, I don't want to go to Israel now. I don't feel like ducking. Anyway, I'm a Jew, so there's no problem. <laughs> the German guy with the rifle. It's a joke. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
no chairmans in here. So, are you going to say I'm a liar? You no, know, I'm not saying you're a liar. I was saying, look, if you remember, I was congratulating you on your newfound fame in Canada. Yeah, well, I, 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 not I, only Canada. You know, this, this, very honestly, when John Landis and my son Larry and, and, a, and a great group of people and Tony O and, and Elliot Weissman and all this put this thing together, yeah. it, it, really, it, it really tells a story of... of how tough a life a comedian can have and how joyous it can be. And for you young people, it's, it's really something I, I think you'll enjoy because it, it tells the personal part of your life and it tells the fun part of your life. And as I hold this in my hand, I want to thank the Academy. Thank you. Damn thing. Give me the damn thing. Sick. Well, you, got all, you got all these different people there. Why, I, why, why am I not in this lineup? You think everybody else there? Because you're everybody. not big enough. What? Come on! No, you're, you're big enough, but I, I, I wanted to keep it funny and happy, you know? <laughs> you stop doing that, you'll break it, for crying out loud. Don't worry, that, this is the American stop one. Stop banging, it's not an x-ray, it's a, it's a show, for crying out loud. Good one, oh, too. Yeah. God bless your kid, keep going. <laughs> <sighs> What about the uh, the Orleans? You go to the Orleans. I yeah, love that room in the Orleans. Uh, yeah, it is. Uh, I, I mean, they've got a bowling alley, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Polish. Anyway, uh, and nothing. For, no, I, the Polish people are great, but they they're big in bowling. Jews don't bowl. We own the alley. Anyway, uh, <laughs> hey, I laughed at your crap. You're gonna start laughing. Right. Right. Oh God! Oh. oh, oh. Anyway, so... <laughs> why, why do you sit like that? Are you, are you, do you think I'm a dentist? Why do you... <laughs> what, 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 you want me to sit next to you? you like no, 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 no. No, no, I'm sitting next to you. I've had enough of that. No, no, no. Yeah, I'm sitting next to you. There you go. I don't want you. I don't want you. Hey. Those are great boots. Well, thank you. Those are great boots. You now, that, that right there, that's your oh, Austin These aren't bad. These are a little right gay, there. but they're not bad. <laughs> No, these are great. These they are, are Your shoes are smart. Yeah, you happy with those? They're what is this, a shoe show? We're doing a regular show here. Right? No, no, we're getting a little more daytimey now. Oh. I'm asking you about... Hey, this you is know. great. It's, it's nice, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I like it. Yeah. Yeah, we're, on, we're on American Airlines. More yeah, peanuts. Yeah. More peanuts. <laughs> yeah. Remember, you go, you go to Germany around the world, right, Scotland? Yeah. I, yeah. I was just on the airline now, and the girl came up and said, Sir, would you care for another round of peanuts? And it's 78 hours, and you get peanuts, you know. <laughs> And I love when, when, when they come, oh, this is the captain. You notice, you can never hear, because I just came from uh, Connecticut, I was up in Foxwoods, and we had a long, from Boston, it's a long ride back, you know. You people, you get out of the house at all, you people? No, no, no. <laughs> so when you come back, it's a long trip. But well, I love from, when, from, from Foxwoods in Connecticut to Boston, that's like two hours. No, no, don't be a smart ass. No. <laughs> I'm just trying to help you. Uh, again, you're yelling. Will you stop no, yelling? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Anyway, so, no, so you come back, and the pilot gets on, you know, like you're maybe two hours from Boston out, and you hear, this is the captain speaking. Well, I'm going to get to and it's hot, 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 hot. And you know, not a very busy seat. Your seat belt, and I'm buying the end. Hot, 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 hot. Crash. Anyway, so. Uh, I was just thinking that. It's a long, long ride. No, how long, you, the, the, the gentleman with the yellow shirt, how long are you married? Uh, Ten years. Do you have to do this? Ten years? <laughs> You got a little spring on your ass that makes you do that? Ten years? Ten years. God bless you. Third wife? Second wife. See? Uh, yeah, not bad. Not bad. You were only one off. Uh, you're, you're, you're very stunning. You, you look like you're very happy. Anyway. Uh, you, know, you know when you talk to these people, we have to pay them. Well, with the money you make, you'll get over yeah, it. Believe yeah, I, don't make any, I, don't I make spoke any to money. Peter LaSalle, your producer, who said to me, it's a little out of line what he makes. You know, you, you do it, you know, you got to think of it. You yeah. were doing comedy sketches on other television shows, yeah. and today you're a big star, you're making a lot of money, you got married. Who are you be talking to? Who are you finished? Let me finish. Oh, you got a big house, got a big house in Malibu. A big house in That's Malibu. right. I met your son who loves to do magic. Oh, my, yeah, my son, yeah, yeah. Your son is like, what, 10, 11? Eight. Eight. I'm yeah. not a kidnapper, you can tell me the truth. No, no, I'm telling you, he's eight. Eight, eight he's, he's adorable, and he does magic. He yeah, comes eight. over here at a dinner party, which we were at, That's and he said, right. what's his name again? Milo. Right! Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> He got it right! Son of a gun! Anyway, move up two steps, you got it right. Anyway, so, I'm really so, glad I remembered so, it, actually. And, and the kid's yeah. adorable. <laughs> don't, when I'm talking, don't Okay, do I'm sorry. Then. This guy here in the front's great. He's sitting like this the whole show. <laughs> the hell are you, a mannequin? Will you, will you stop talking to me? We have to pay them. I told you we have to pay don't them. Don't get over it. The, the whole front row. These guys are great. They, they really dressed up for the show. They're, yeah, sitting yeah. There, they're sitting there in their underwear, for crying out loud. <laughs> 
Anyway, so, so the, his son, his son, adorable kid, he comes up and says, Mr. Rickles, want to see some magic? And, and I'm having a couple of vodkas, and I'm not in the mood for no eight-year-old kid pulling on my pants to do magic, you know. And he goes, watch this, Mr. Rickles. Turn around, boom, boom, disappear. And of course, he's an eight-year-old kid, and you go, so, so where's the magic? That, what, watch this again, Mr. Rickles. Disappear. <laughs> so I slapped him in the face, and he went away. Oh. No, that's a joke. He that's, was ador he's adorable, but he loves to do magic. Tell him I tell him I talked about him, okay? Yeah, well, sure. <laughs> I, to be honest, I mean you're a legend, Don. But with the eight-year-old set, I just don't know how much. Uh, they'll that's learn going. someday. All right, if I'm God just lets saying. me live, they'll know someday. Right, oh, well, by the way, yeah? I was in New York recently. I got a segue because you're not a big help. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I, I, was, I was in New York. This is. Okay, I'm listening, this, I'm listening. And gang, listen, any of you in New Yorkers know this. And I love New York. I was born and raised in New York. And so a couple of weeks ago, we're in New York, and we came out of Elaine's. That's a very prominent restaurant there, which we hang out late at night. And we're coming out of Elaine's uh, late at night. And you, you have these gentlemen that are in bad trouble. You know, I don't want to use the word beggars. They're not beggars. They're people in trouble. Well, they're beggars. Yeah. Anyway, uh, <laughs> but they're people in trouble, really. A lot of homeless. We've got a lot of economic problems, which you all know, but I won't get into that. But anyway, so we're walking down the street. My wife and I and a few people. Uh -huh. And the guy says, oh, Mr. Rickles, Mr. Rickles, please. And I use that voice because that's how they sound. Yeah. Mr. Rickles, please, please, help me, help me. Uh, yeah, 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 get, get a few dollars. Give me, give me something, Mr. Rickles, Mr. Rickles. And I always have a set thing that I do all the time. I take a $5 bill out of my pocket and I say, here's $5, buy yourself a ranch. Okay? And the guy goes, thank you, Mr. Rickles. And we walk away. And that, usually that's the end of it. And as we're walking up the street, this same man comes running after me. Now, Mr. Rickles, we need cattle. 